Now, I had been meaning to do something about this Ray Rice shit because this is a perfect Mr. Monkey 7 topic. It's It's got the hood speaking out. It's got a lot of people speaking out. It's got the females speaking out. It's got the white guys speaking out. That's all you need, man. That's all you need for a Mr. Monkey 7 guy. And this is going to be my guy right here. It's going to be my ticket to ranting about something. So I'm going to watch the Ray Rice knockout video right now. Let's see my reaction. TMZ Sports. Oh, this girl's actually kind of valid from the distance. White girls, man. That's my shit. Oh, no, is she a little Asian, too? I don't know. Like, I'm seeing the hands being thrown and shit, but I don't know what to make of it. I don't know, he's kind of like, what? why is he picking your ass up and like, dragging her like that? Her fucking 199 target flip flops fell out and shit. Come on, she's looking like a damn mess. You got the hands, like, uh. That shit is power like I I couldn't do that. What the fuck? I mean it wasn't as bad as the beatdown Chris Brown gave to Rihanna and the whole hood's pointing out the hypocrisy. The elevator door, if that was like one of those cheap project building elevator doors, she would have lost her head. Like I know I, I have like these friends that used to go to their elevator all the time because they wanted to visit them. And they had some shitty ass elevators. Her neck would have been twisted up right there, but the sensor, though. The sensor picked up the fact that there was an obstruction. It's good. Okay. So now there's this guy in a suit, and he's just trying to assess the situation. They're all talking to his <laughs> Girlfriend's looking like she's having... She's having one of those days. She's over here like looking like the thinker, Indian style too. All lurched over and shit. Is she crying? Uh, this is kind of the point where I'm feeling like the security camera need they need some audio. Oh, now he's like grabbing her flip flops. I don't know why. Oh, you got you got people outside like consoling her. Shit. They took care of the situation a lot better than he did. He was just like putting her on like a full Nelson, like trying to drag her to the room or some shit. It was stupid. If you're going to knock out your girlfriend, at the very least, I know what I'm saying is really douchey to you. At the very least, you should know what to do right afterwards. I bet you the comments are just gonna be guys saying I hate black people. I got those people saying I hate white people. And then the gender thing. I swear that's everything in terms of YouTube nowadays. Every topic is just the race thing, the sex thing.
back and forth whenever something viral like this happens. That's why it's perfect for Mr. Wonka 7. Oh, damn. But I don't know what to make of that. I mean, it is what it is. The guy's career is over. That sucks and everything, but... I feel like his career should have ended because of that incident. No. I really don't think so. What he did was stupid. The way he did it was even worse, where he really didn't... <laughs> I think he's more of an asshole for, like, trying to full Nelson drag his girlfriend out of the elevator after he knocks the shit out of her. Knocks her the fuck out and doesn't know what, how to, like, take care of her afterwards. That's just dumb. I mean, if... Let's put it in a way where no one's gonna look at this in black and white. If my parents were to knock my ass out in public, not around a bunch of people, just like in a... I'd say an elevator of a private building. I mean, it's not like our apartment or our house or something of that nature, but let's say they knock my ass out. Are they going to drag me out full Nelson style? No, they're not. I, mean, I don't know what hold he did, but I guarantee you, if that if he followed that shit up with a suplex, that weird-ass hold he did, like... The IWC would love it. Smart Marks and indie wrestlers, they would want him to have a wrestling contract, which... Hell, I think he's found a new calling with those hands and... That hold he did, that weird-ass hold. He's done a bunch of holds, because he didn't know what to do with her limpid, nearly comatose body. He, he should go for MMA, UFC, Bellator, uh... If there was still strike force, if they didn't unify that shit with UFC and shit, you should go for that, because he's an all-around guy with that, I guess. Provided the target can't defend himself, and considering a lot of MMA guys are built like me, fuck. Like, there you go, man. Like, uh, that, that's something you could do. I overstayed my welcome in this video, didn't I? Definitely did. I mean, this video was only three and a half minutes. Fuck y'all, niggas. That's all I gotta say. This has been Mr. Monka 7. Suck my dick. Peace.